We are so excited to be the first install in the U.S. This being the first L2 installation in North America is extremely significant. I'm extremely excited for the new L2 system. This is a dream come true. First Avenue was founded as the depot in 1970. It was converted from the old Greyhound bus station, where the main room is now was the waiting area for the passengers. It was founded as sort of a answer to the rock and roll ballrooms that were springing up on the coasts. It premiered with the first show by Joe Cocker on April 3rd, 1970. I mean, if I didn't say First Avenue was most famous for Prince, I would be lying. It was his musical home. When he wanted to try out new things, performing all the music that became the Purple Rain album. Prince shot Purple Rain, the concert scenes of, of Purple Rain. We're somewhat famous for having a wall of stars outside honoring some of the legendary acts that have come through. The First Avenue main room really is, you know, every young musician's dream of where to play. I first heard about L-Acoustics when we were looking for a PA for the Palace Theater in 2016. We were introduced to the L2 by Allied. It was a little bit of a risk because it hadn't, hadn't been installed in any other clubs. Uh, we're gonna wanna zoom in on this. L2 installs so easily. You're only having four points of contact per box. It's literally latch, push a button, schlack. Using the auto filter, is essentially everything that is dictating the different circuits within the box. I believe L2 is correct for this historic venue due to its sleek nature. I mean, just look at the product. It's beautiful in the space. And how it really like opens up sight lines and how the beauty of it really complements, you know, the, the natural beauty of our room, the deco curves. What we were also hoping for, along with the aesthetics, was the ability to give everybody in the venue an equal audio experience. And I will say, judging by the audio tests, you know, but I just heard we achieved that and so much more. First take was it sounded amazing. I could tell right away I walked around the room a little bit just to hear it from different points. And it was noticeable right away how like even and clear the sound was at various places all around the room. L2 sounds extremely natural from the front to the back of the audience area. Meaning high frequency and low frequencies match. It's extremely seamless. You can't tell that there's any difference between drivers or anything like that. You really truly going in. You're trying to make sure that I have one of the best days of my life. The tools we use should enable whatever the performer wants. The cardioid behavior of L2 is going to be great for performers on stage. The stage is going to be so much cleaner, especially from a low end aspect. Imagine being up there and it's as if the PA is not even on. The artists are not gonna be dealing with all of the bounce back from the PA and they're gonna be able to hear the wedges more clearly. They can hear themselves, they can hear their bandmates better because there's not that usual traditional noise on stage that they have to overcome. The audience will notice a difference whether or not they know anything about speakers. Because the cardioid behavior is so dramatic, and the dB reduction behind is so incredibly high, what you perceive as an audience member is a more direct, forward sound. It's going to uh, just focus all that energy, especially on the low end, you know, you're gonna feel that kick drum in your chest. You're gonna feel the bass vibrating throughout the building. You're gonna feel the snare drum. I think L2 is going to immerse the audience more and make them uh, connect more. It just feels like our wildest dream come true.